In this video, we are going to take a look at how to design a custom Valentine card like this in Photoshop. A link to download all the resources we'll be using in this tutorial will be given in the description so you can check them out to follow suit. Let's get into the magic world of Photoshop. So here in Photoshop, the first thing we are going to do is to create a new document. So we are going to open our file and click on new. So when we click on new, we are going to be creating a 4x4 inches flyer. We are going to be using a resolution of 300. So we just press OK. So after doing that, next off we are going to be creating our gradient background. So I'm just going to come over here to this place and click here and click on my gradient. So I've already set the gradient pack. I'm just going to give you the X code so you can just use them and follow suit. So the first stop for this gradient is 3F000. So why the second stop for this gradient is B10307. Yeah, just like that. I press OK. So we are going to tweak some values here just to make it suit our taste. So I'm going to change this one to radial. I'm going to leave the angle at 90 and the scale at 100. But I'm going to reverse it so I can have this kind of good looking background and shining light from the middle. So you can just press OK.
reduce it just like that just a little bit to any size you are okay with you are okay with you can just leave it there just like that so after doing that you can hold the two circles using control key so you can press control a now so you can centralize the two circles in the middle just like that press control d you can bring the two circles down using your arrow keys to bring them down a little bit so you can have a, a glimpse of the day font yes just like that so you can change the color of the upper smaller circle just like that here we double click here and change it to any color of your choice just like that so i used my image on the layer thumbnail but and i'm not going to be linking down in the description so we can use this love as an experiment so we bring it in here just like that you can take it you can also take your picture from here just like this to photoshop so you can just bring it in here over it on photoshop and bring it in just like that to photoshop and you can press ok so we right click here and we press create clipping mark so it clips the image to the circle that is under it so you can use any image that you want of your choice in this place and you'll be fine with it let's add our text tool and we are good to go so we pick our text tool just like that and we type we're going to be using the font called railway so i'm just going to be typing railway font just like that and i'm going to be using semi bold yeah just like that semi bold so we are just going to be typing from me to you just like that press ok pick our pick tool just like that. so we can press ctrl c to enlarge it a little bit using our shift and our alt key just like that and once you are okay with it you can press ok we press ctrl a and we press this align horizontal so just like that it aligns it just like that and we press ctrl d you can bring the from me to you a little bit down so next off we're going to pick our text tool also again and we're going to type i love you just like that so we type it i love you so we are going to press ctrl to select everything and we are going to be using medium italic for this one so we press ok pick our pick to and reduce the size of this one and press ctrl t to reduce the size just like that so we reduce the size to a minimum size you are okay with and press ok so we can bring it here just like that we can press ctrl a to centralize it just like that we can use the arrow tools to bring them down so we can have a spacing between the two of them so we can bring it down just like that i hope you've been able to learn something new in this tutorial thank you so much for watching this video please don't forget to like and subscribe subscription is free and i will see you in the next one it's tolu here and bye